Well, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and here you have a wacko uh, nutcase who apparently doesn't understand constitutional, constitutional law at all. Her name is Ann M. Ravel, former FEC, Federal Elections Commission chairwoman, and she says that the internet has to be Political speech on the internet has to be regulated in order to protect us. This is this is just plain evil. It's what they do in third world countries. Uh, what she's really saying is, of course, that only leftist political speech is to be allowed. That is, I'm going to point out that this is specifically forbidden. By our constitutional constitution, First Amendment clearly states Congress, you know, shall not uh, regulate political speech. Sorry, uh, Mrs. Communist, this is specifically forbidden. Speaking at an event called Future Democracy. Ravel argued the proliferation of fake news and political advertising on platforms like Facebook influenced elections. In other words, she wanted hologram Hillary to win. She warned that the lack of disclosure by the creators of those these campaigns was becoming a huge problem. We know there's a lot of campaigning that moved to the internet, whether it was through fake news or just outright advertising, and there's no Almost no regulation of this, very little. Uh, she said, and that's, and so that's the disclosure we expect as to who is behind the campaigns not going to exist soon. Some people are even predicting that by 2020, most of the advertising is going to be move from television to the internet, and I think this is a serious issue, serious issue that requires a lot of discussion. Continued travel. During her tenure of the chairwoman of the FEC, Ravel previously called for the right-leaning websites like Drudge Report to be regulated. That just proves what I uh, said, and blamed hostile responses toward her proposals on misogyny. No, it's because you're a hardcore leftist who wants to silence anybody who doesn't agree with you. She claimed that it was within the purview of the FEC to overlook internet politi political activities, including the area of airing of political viewpoints. So, Christ. Now I have, first we have YouTube censoring our videos, and now this witch wants to take that a step further and tell us, hey, screw you, shut your mouth. We're in charge. Shut your mouth. You don't, you don't have the right to say it. Say it if we don't agree with it. That's what she's saying. In 2015, Democrats tried or but failed to expand the FEC's regulatory powers to cover social media posts and other forms of political speech on the internet, which are not subject to the same scrutiny as political advertisements on old media. At the time, liberal watchdogs complained to the FEC with allegations that the improbable presidential candidates like Jeb Bush and Martin O'Malley were skirting finance laws to campaign. Conservatives may install the vote, fearing that additional powers would chill political speech on the internet. Since then, Ravel has only doubled down in her speech at UC Berkeley. Ravel claims companies like Facebook have no real knowledge of who sponsors the posts of political viewpoints on their platforms. They don't have to. I think this is a really serious issue that we need to address, she said. Uh... Excuse me, I'm going to say this one more time. This is specifically forbidden. 
we are supposed to be protected from this type of regulating our speech. Madam, this is specifically forbidden. It is illegal. Uh, you, madam, are a nut job in my book. How in the hell you ever got into any type of political situation, I don't know. Unbelievable. Now, I've said a couple of different words, so I suppose... Uh... What's it? It's going to take it. Uh, demonetize at YouTube. I don't care, I don't make any money. I'm not getting any views anyway, they shut me out. <sighs> Cripes. That's all we don't need is someone like this. Going and saying, well, <laughs> we need to shut those conservatives up. That's what this is about. It's about telling if you're a conservative, you're a Republican, they don't want you to be able to speak your mind. That's what this amounts to. Now, artifacts of Mars, leftists are on the march as usual. Thanks for watching.